What's going on, YouTube? My name is FG3000, back in the place to be, and welcome to Gigantic, a game I thought would never, ever come out, but it finally did, um, and it's actually not bad at all. So hold on. Some, some slappies over here. Oh, I got you, buddy boy. How about some death from above? Ooh, 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 ooh. So I'm not going to spend a lot of time in this video talking about the actual, like, concepts and the how the game works and any of that stuff. The game is free. It's on Steam. Check it out. Ah, oh, man, we got to defend. Ah, oh, I really want to fight some more, but we better go defend. So I'm not really going to talk about the actual mechanics of the game. Um, we'll mostly just, you know, have some fun and do some gameplay here. So we're about to jump on defense here. This game is really good looking, and I will say, since I last covered the game, um, the FPS is way better than it was before. It used to be... I saw someone. Is she in Viz? Yeah, you're, you're done for. That, that kind of stuff will not happen. <laughs> if you want to kind of suicide on our point like that, not going to happen. All right, so we're good there. So let's, um, I want to stay with my melee dude over here. The map is so freaking useful in this game. Whoops. <laughs> As I go the wrong way. All right. So let's head to, to point D here. I'm going to try to go. You better get out of here. I had your back there, buddy. I had your back. All right, let's uh, make sure we keep upgrading here. Uh, sure. That, that part right there I'm not really used to just yet. I assume that once you kind of know your characters, um, upgrading your skills in the middle of combat won't be as clunky and cumbersome. Oh, come on, dude. I'm an FPS master. <laughs> um, but as of right now, it's like... It kind of takes you out of the action just a little bit. I'm going to upgrade this guy to a, a better healer. There we go. And we're going to head over to point D. If I can. Oh, I got you. Crap. That was not the best play FG's ever done. I don't want to fight those solo. Let's just kind of uh, hang out here with our sprint region. Oh, hello. I'll see you guys later. <laughs> I will see you guys later. See, this is the part that I got to get used to because I usually run to the point way too fast. Somebody around here? Oh god, what a misplay there, FG. Stay away from that thing. Oh well, they got me there. That's four versus one. But maybe my team can do something? No, they're a mile away. So we weren't able to get anything on that attack there, unfortunately. Now my only beef with this game so far... Hold on, we're level five, so we get this ability here. Let's see. Sure, and then we'll go poisons last longer, yes. Damage at close range, honor, yes. All right, let's go straight up the gut, right up the middle. Game is beautiful. I don't think anyone can say anything bad about how good the game looks. It is a really nice looking game. You little, you little, you little, you little evasive little, you gave me the slip. You gave me the slip? Oh, that is ruthless. All right. Let's head over to our team here. We got a lot of people over here on point F. They could do with a more pronounced announcer, however. 
throw that behind you just in case you want to go backwards. Drop, drop my Victor ultimate. If you've played Paladins, that's basically what my ultimate is. Alright, see, right now I'm here too early. Like, I'm just putting myself in danger. I've, I've arrived way too early. Okay, I can see it on the map. Okay, so I can see... But still, I'm here way too early. <laughs> Well, I got two people here. Maybe that can help my team a little bit. Does it help? Did you get them? Did you get anything? <laughs> All right. Uh, further they travel with full ammo deals that. Fly for longer. Sure. We'll go with that. I'm not sure if we got anything out of that. I'm still so new that I really can't read everything here. So... So you have to have 100 points in order to attack. So we're, it's 10 to 10 in that respect. I'm not sure what those other things are. Those little uh, diamonds at the top of those numbers mean. We'll, we'll get there. Oh, man, that was a pro move there, buddy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Death from a boom! <laughs> Let's kill this stupid thing. Sit my poison. Boom! Very very nice team. All right. Ooh. I said the map was really good. I, I just suck at the map. Okay, it's time to attack now. I can take my time a little bit. I think I've learned my lesson finally. I don't need to just run out there like a, a crazy person. Okay, she's almost there. There she is. Come on, dance in my poison with me. Dance in this poison. Oh, crap. Where'd she go? Yeah, I still don't know what the heck's going on here for the most part. I still don't know exactly what's going on. <laughs> I thought I did. I Apparently I don't. Alright. Let's see here. Yes. You can jump one at no. I want to do that. Because I love doing death from above. That's like my favorite thing to do. Let's go right up the gut. Platforming skills, baby. It's a very fast-paced game. Thank you for taking that for me. Wait, wait, wait. What's that? Oh, great. Didn't kill us. Let's run back to A really quick. Let's heal up. Rampage, prepare to defend. We'll be fine. Dance, dance, dance. Oh, dude. Did you think that I was, uh... go defend because I'm being a really bad teammate. Alright, we're good. We're good. Oh, man, y'all got lucky. See, right now, I don't know. Okay, I see it now. So we have two hearts. They have one heart. So we just need to hit them one more time. Is that correct? I can't read this. I can't read this UI. <laughs> Not yet, at least. That's that's not a, a diss against the game. That's a diss against that's a diss against me for just not being quite there yet. Okay. 
Yeah, this game is wild. Like, everything is just... Oh, you're, you're done for, buddy boy. Oh, can I get that bloomer? Can I get him before I... Mm, you're not paying attention to me. You're not paying attention to me. Got him. Totally worth. Alright, I think... Uh... Ooh, nice heal. I didn't know you were a healer. Oh, man. Alright. Got another skill point. Now, this is my only small beef with the game. Is that there is... I don't really like this cannon that much, but whatever. My only kind of beef with the game is, now that we're both level 10, both teams are exactly even. Like, there's no... You quickly get to the point, like, think of, like, Smite or, like, League of Legends where everyone has a full build. Like, you're, that's where we are right now. Everyone basically has a full build. So it's just kind of like, even if you were, like, kicking butt, you don't really have any advantages at all, which is kind of interesting. Oh, is that it? That's GG. <laughs> Quick match, though. What? That's bugged. Nice. Yeah. Ooh, give me that card. Mm. Oh, that's the only card that did? Oh, that's most hero kills. You got that right. I'm cast 350 in this game. That's my old name. Um, so you saw those cards there. So if you take a look here, usually when you... So right now, I can't draw any, but occasionally you'll be able to draw cards. And if you see... These cards are basically quests. I don't know why they decided to call them cards. People are like card crazy when it comes to games these days. Everybody wants to shove cards in their game for I don't know what reason. But um, you get to draw cards and these are just basically quests. So as you can see right here, um, all I got to do is just complete one more match and I'll get this card. Once I get this card, I get uh, 1,000 gold or whatever. Once I reach account level 10, I'll get 1,000 gold. Uh, what is this? Kill an enemy hero that recently dealt damage to one of your creatures. Successfully defend your guardian from receiving a wound. I thought I did that, but apparently I didn't. So I didn't complete that quest that match. Deal 100,000 damage to enemy heroes. Doesn't tell me how much I've done. Yes, it does. 20k I've done so far in one match. So I'll be able to knock that out. And then end uh, three enemy killing sprees. So that's that. So as you... As you play the game, you get to unlock cards. These cards are basically basically quests. You complete the quest to get gold, and then you can use that gold to buy things that are in the cash shop here. Um, you can also use some of your uh, actual cash shop currency to do that a little bit faster. Um, I will not. <laughs> um, the price ranges for characters range from 5,000 up to 10,000. So you can kind of see some of the older, old school characters. If you've been watching this game for the, the years that I've been, a lot of these characters are really old, and they've been in the game for a while, so. Um, 5,000, 10,000 here for Imani. This snowman looking guy is 10K. This, uh, yeah, 5,000 for that one. 10K for Zendora, who just looks kind of out of place. I don't know why. For some reason, she just doesn't look as detailed. It's like she only has like three colors on her, but eh, she's probably pretty cool. Vodin, 10k, 13k, so I lied. It goes up to 13,000 gold. And this is one of the newest characters that just joined the game, um, which is pretty interesting. So even a brand new character to the game, you can still use your gold to buy the character. There's a lot of games out there that won't let you buy the newest character. Um, not in this instance. So you can buy this for 13k. Chardock for 5k. Wu for 10k. 5k for Mozu. The Swift here, he's 5k. Does he only have one arm? Looks like it. One arm and a little rat. Uncle Steven, 7, 5k. 10k for Trip. Vadasi is 10k. Oh, wow, that's pretty cool. I've not seen her before. I like that. 10k there. And 5k for her. And then we didn't get a chance to see her, but that's a pretty cool design there for 10k. And meh, I didn't like him too much. And there's Beckett. All right, so that's pretty much what you can use your your money for right now. You can use gold to unlock characters. And there is, of course, a shop where you can buy skins. I just don't know where they all are. Here are all the skins for Trip. Okay. So a lot of them are just color swaps. 
But then there are some that are uh, model swaps as well. So this Bleeding Edge is one that looks totally different than her base, of course. And then there are weapons that you can unlock as well, which I do like very much. Very cool. So they, they kind of went the Paladins route there where you can have a skin and weapons separately. Um, how do I go to more people? How do I go to more peoples? Yeah, whatever. <laughs> whatever. You, you, you got the idea. Can I do it this way? Huh? No? No? And then there, this is actually pretty interesting. I haven't really done a lot of research on this, but the creatures that you summon at points, you can also do different types of creatures as well. And they do have different abilities. So I think at the end of the day, they're pretty similar. No, this is actually a straight up upgrade, isn't it? So this one, everything is exactly the same. Oh, it costs more focus though. More focus, okay, so just really depends on what you're looking for. Because these do cost more focus. Look at these dragons here as well. And I haven't even seen this before. It's probably a little bit later. So what else is there? Starter packs. Ah, oh, great. I'm in Steam. <laughs> there is like an Ultimate God pack like in Smite. So if you want to just buy it once and get all of the heroes from forever and forever, you can absolutely do that. I'm, I'm mad because how do you look at other heroes' uh, skins? Like, how do you do that? Like, if I go to Heroes and I go to... Yeah. How do I look at all the skins that you... There we go. There we go. So, of course, a bunch of color swaps. But then some straight-up different skins. It's kind of cool. There you go. Weapons. What kind of weapon? Oh, just your little pouch there on the side. Not a big difference between you. Oh, well, that's a pretty big difference. Okay. What else we got here? The video is pretty much over. I'm just looking at stuff. <laughs> Very interesting there. Okay, she looks a little cooler now with the skin. And then you can change her weapon if you want. Let's keep on going here. Uh, he'll, he'll probably have some really cool bows in the future. Oh, nice. I like snow. And this is the newest character there. I don't know what he's all about, but there he is. So anyway, guys, that is gigantic. It is free to play on Steam. It's also one of those annoying games where you play it. You d Wait, it's one of those annoying games where you download it on Steam and then it opens up its own launcher. So you do still have to play the game through the Arc launcher, which is super annoying. So you're gonna have to log in. So you're gonna have to have an Arc account and you have to log into Arc, even though you're playing on Steam. So, so annoying. Like. Game developers and all your freaking launchers for your three or four games that you have. It's just so annoying. Um, the only people that get a little slack on it is because Blizzard is massive. But for the most part, we just want to just use Steam or nothing, you know? Uh, but that's that. My name is FG3000. That is gigantic. Check it out. It's doing really well on Steam. I think it's right around 8,000 players concurrently right now. And it's probably going to keep going up because it's a pretty fun time. Um, when you first look at it, it's very messy. But as you play more and more games, you get used to it, and uh, it just becomes a little bit easier to play. Um, so check it out, and I'll see you guys next video. Later.